There's a perfect little spot now that that sun's popped out right on that corner, right there in that shade. Hey, welcome back everybody. You saw me just a few minutes ago catch one underneath that dark shade of that corner and you see there's an identical spot right here and I got one way back in there and I was talking about swimming it out. Just let it swim on its own out here right on that outside edge. Got him. There he is. Oh, another good one. Better fish are starting to... Oh, he got off. Ah, did I get him? I got him. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get that to happen very often. He came off and I made a mad swat with the net and I caught him out of there. Oh wow. Well, I tell you, this is a great, a great way to catch fish. And I mentioned that uh, you're fishing for fish that don't get beat up so much. All the fish up around the shoreline and the bank get, get hammered a lot, but these fish live out here under the shade. And let me tell you one thing real important here. Depth makes zero difference. It doesn't matter whether you're in 10 feet or 70 feet of water. It's that dock that's holding the fish. And remember, when you're fishing under these docks, you're only fishing, say, the top 10 feet of the water column. Don't worry about letting that bait try to fall to the bottom. In fact, you're below the fish. Fish the upper 10 feet and just think in terms of, even though it's 60 feet deep, it's only 10 feet deep in your mind and fish that top 10 feet of the water column in the shade and think edges. Fish the outside edges, flip it back in there deep, swim it to the outside edge and many times it's right along that shade line is where they're going to bite.